everyone and welcome once again to the Bucket Broadcast Bucket Binge where I try out some tasty treats from around the world. Now, is this one a World Tour Wednesday or is it a Bucket Binge from Japan? I don't know because today's item is a Nissin Cup Noodles Sukiyaki Beef Instant Instant Cup Noodle. Now, I don't think Cup Noodle by Nissin needs any introduction not really but if it does just in case it is the first and number one cup noodle brand in the world perhaps uh, in japan at the very least uh, they have incredible commercials so just type old nissin cup noodle into uh, youtube and you'll find hopefully some incredible advertisements that they've run in the past and I found them in our local supermarket. They were uh, reduced from £1.75 down to about 70p. So a great bargain right now in uh, January. I found them in Sainsbury's in the UK at 70p. And there were other uh, flavours besides. There was tonkotsu pork and there was seafood. And I think there was a chicken. But today I have the sukiyaki beef. Now, Cup Noodles, I believe they're the guys that have the Cup Noodle Museum in Japan. I wouldn't be surprised if they if they were. Um, I'm not sure which brand of Cup Noodles is more popular across the world. I think it might be Top Ramen in um, America. Here in the UK, it's Pot Noodle. And in Japan, certainly in Japan, it is Cup Noodle. Now, they're cheap and widely available in Japan, but here in the UK... They are probably one of the premium brands of cup noodles, certainly at £1.75 for one cup. Here it is, I'm going to show you the cup. Very, very nice design. It's got like a textured paper. It's it's kind of a soft, almost fabric um, feel to it. It's got a very premium feel to the cup. And as you can see, it's got some lovely design and um, illustrations on there uh, it's got the instructions the fill instructions on the front uh, and let's have a look at the ingredients it's sukiyaki beef flavor just going to see if it actually includes if it says how much meat is in there um, beef fat powder that's probably where all the flavor comes from doesn't say if there's any actually real pieces of beef in there probably not for um, preservation uh, reasons probably isn't any and it's produced in Hungary by Nissin Foods uh, and here's the blurb on the side um, invented in Japan in 1971 cup noodles were the world's first instant noodles in a pot I can recommend um, I think Japanology or Japangle on uh, NHK world Hopefully it's been archived somewhere uh, on YouTube, perhaps. But uh, there was a really good uh, small documentary on cup noodles that explains all of this. But I've prepared my noodles in advance. My chopsticks are sitting on top of the pot, waiting to go. So I'm going to... I can see some brown pieces in there. And some onion and some carrot. But the idea is, it's supposed to be sukiyaki beef flavor hmm. so it doesn't look like there's much in the way of toppings anymore they've all probably sunk to the bottom not particularly strong on the flavors just yet not so strong it's probably all in the soup flavors all in the soup Standard noodles, I think. What I'd like to do is get one of these, get a cup noodle version, a Nissin cup noodle, and compare it to the cheapest possible version of a cup noodle I can find of the same and see if there's any noted change in the quality. See, that looks like beef. Flavour, not very strong. No, not really. I suppose cup noodle noodles are in a league of their own because when you have ramen the, the noodles are very very thick which I love a little bit beefy in the soup maybe if I'd put less water in 
it would be better. Maybe the sauce would be thicker. I think a good thick sauce which adheres to the noodles is a really good thing to have. I think noodles in a soup, not so much. I think I've had enough that I can come to a conclusion when it comes to these noodles. I want stronger flavours. The thing is, the same old vegetables are always in these noodles. You always get your spring onion. Spring onion is always such an overpowering flavour. Uh, carrot, roasted onion. The roasted onion's good. And those are always... I'd like to have cup noodles without those overpowering flavours. I think if it weren't for those, I'd be able to taste the soup, the sauce a bit more. So, it's nice to have convenience, hot food, to be honest. You know, kettle, hot food, and the cup. I like that a lot. Very convenient. I don't have them nearly often enough. So... For not living up to expectations it's a five out of ten i'm afraid sukiyaki nissin cup noodle five out of ten i was expecting a lot better i was expecting beefier flavors but i'm really not getting the beef flavor i'm just getting beef ish soup but it's mostly the veg it's mostly the carrot and the onion and to be honest you don't really get carrots that often in, in ramen and stuff I find so I don't know why I'm comparing it to ramen when this is supposed to be a sukiyaki cup noodle I was expecting a lot better out of this um, normally high priced high branded item so thank you for watching uh, maybe I'll do more noodles in the future who knows that's a uh, probably quite a good idea so until next time uh, we'll catch you again have a look at the rest of our reviews I do sweets and drinks and Howard does music and until next time Ciao, ciao.